Well, howdy, folks. How y'all is? Pulling through my favorite East Texas town, Jefferson. And uh, I'm going to go over here to the general store and maybe grab a Moody Dog. It's late in the day. I got a late start today getting to Louisiana. So, uh, yeah, it's a cool town right here, though. Cool town. Anyway, we're going to go over here to the general store and uh, see if they got any Moody Dogs left and uh, grab a quick bite to eat. If you've been watching my channel for a long time, you know this is one of my favorite little stops. Uh, coming from Texas into uh, Louisiana. So, yeah, let's go check it out. See if they got a Moody Dog for us and, uh, yeah, I'll show you what it looks like. The Moody Dog. Nash do still have five cent coffee. It's pretty cool. All right, folks, they're out of Moody Dogs. I kind of figured it's like 6.30 in the evening, but a super cool general store, nevertheless. All right, let's get out of here. Well, that's a bummer. I sure was wanting a Moody Dog today, but uh, yeah, kind of figured this time of day they just sell out mid afternoon. But uh, yeah, man, it's a cool town. There's an old haunted hotel down here I stayed at. And uh, we'll go find you some food somewhere along the way down here. Well, this is the second oldest town in Texas, and uh, it's got that cool, you know, French architecture. Alrighty folks, we're here in Natchitoches, Louisiana, the oldest town in Louisiana, the French Market. And uh see here, I got uh again, I got four boudin balls and uh some loaded uh tater tot uh top thing. Let's see what it looked like. There we go. So we got boudin here and loaded uh potato there. All right. And then over here. We got some crawfish pies. Yeah, let's try some crawfish pies. Ooh, looky there, folks. All right, let's see what these things taste like. All right, it's not time, so it's kind of dark out here, but uh, I'm trying to give y'all a view of what we have in here. So let's try this, uh, this boudin first. Actually, this is the potato. Let's try the potato first. Then we'll get into boudin and crawfish pie, and a Philly gumbo. It's not bad, it's kinda like a hash brown casserole deep fried. Alrighty folks, let's try out this here. 
Boudin ball. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. So if you're not familiar with boudin balls, it's basically like dirty rice. If you go to Popeyes or somewhere, if you don't live anywhere around this southern part of the world, a lot of places have Popeyes and they used to have dirty rice. And it's like you scoop it up, ball it up, and deep fry. And it's delicious as hell. Mmm. Mm-mm-mm. Use my reverse camera and it's not real good. It's not as good as the front camera, but anyway. Here at the French market. And uh, they always get praise on their crawfish pies. It's being some of the best around. So let's dig into a crawfish pie. Mmm. Oh man. Delicious. Got some corn in there. Mm-hmm. Right there's the inner fillings. Good stuff. Kind of like an empanada or something like that. They got meat versions, but I like the crawfish version. 